Shabbat Shalom, Temple Sinai. This Shabbat, our Torah portion is Kitavo, and Kitavo has lots of interesting pieces in it. One of them is a commandment to build a big landmark. We're actually told to construct big uh, monuments that remind us of the Ten Commandments, big tablets, to remind us of what the rules are so that we follow them. As Americans, we do this all the time, right? We go to Washington, D.C., and there are lots of memorials that remind us of all sorts of things, war memorials, memorials to particular people. Um, there aren't so many memorials to laws as a law, which is an interesting gift that, that we as Jews receive and inherit through this Torah portion. Uh, and one of the interesting things is that through the, the decades, there have always been people who've wanted to put a Ten Commandments memorial up in front of the courthouse. The challenge is, and the problem is, that there are multiple versions of the Ten Commandments. In our own Torah, there's one version in Exodus and one version in Deuteronomy. This week we're, we'll be talking about the Deuteronomy one, but we read it a few weeks ago. Um, but the Christians have their own versions. There's a Catholic version and a Protestant version. So when you want to put a monument up to the Ten Commandments, whose Ten Commandments are you going to put up? Uh, this becomes a fascinating challenge. And the Torah portion, in telling us to put up this monument, doesn't tell us which version to follow. Uh, which is itself really interesting because it means that the Torah doesn't know that itself it, it, it contains two different versions. Uh, and so what we're really called to do is to remember the people who came before us, to remember the societies that existed before us, to remember the structures they created, and to remember what they did to make society more whole. If we do that, then going forward, hopefully we'll make the same good choices and we'll be able to propel humanity forward. There are lots of ways to do that here at the temple. I hope you'll join us. Friday evening, we have Tach Shabbat at 5. Um, our main service is at 7 o'clock. Saturday morning, Torah study at 8.30 and service is at 9.15. Saturday evening is um, Slichot. And before Slichot, we have a fascinating uh, panel discussion on the role of abortion in a post-Roe world. Um, and we're thrilled to welcome both an OBGYN and a law professor to talk about the, the medical and legal sides of it. As well, I'll be adding in some of the, the Jewish perspective. So it promises to be a wonderful conversation. That will lead us into Slichot. Uh, and you can hear the music now in the background in my office. And then on Sunday, we have Next Door. Uh, and we have uh, on Monday evening, uh, Watts has a wonderful program on listening to and respecting the other voter, the voter who votes different from the way you do. Uh, so there's lots going on at the temple, lots of different ways to remember and honor our tradition and to honor our history as we build a better society. For now, Shabbat Shalom. Look forward to seeing you soon at the temple and hope this is a Shabbat that's filled with good memories that motivate us to do well.